Kelsey's just started learning the rainbow song at school and comes home every day singing red and yellow and pink and green. Oh, sorry, my singing is terrible. Uh, so this is a really fun way of embracing her newfound love of colours and singing the rainbow song. So today we're going to be talking. I'll be talking through how we made this rainbow book out of old paint swatches. So really, we were inspired by a recent trip to Bunnings. Uh, we've just painted our new house and she got an extra special pink broom. So we had a few paint Good samples job. left over and she's been playing Hi. with them, singing out the colours of pink and purple. And then Hi. on our recent trip to Bunnings, we were able to pick up a few more colours to make the complete set of rainbow uh, and it was super easy to make. So all you need is the paint swatches, some colourful contact, some stickers and some uh, window rings, just the ones that you sort of hang curtains on through the rod that connect together and they can either be plastic or um, metal. All you then need to do is glue together the paint swatches together um, back to back to form a bit of a book layout. You then just need to find some contact, which again, as I said, was a jelly bean, and cover the front and the back page with contact. You then need to, um, to make it into a book, punch two holes on the side of each card. So make sure you do this, you've agreed and decided on your order, so it's good to place it together and make sure it works as a book. Um, and then all you need to do is put the curtain rings through the two holes, hole punched holes, um, to facilitate it turning like a book. So you can see here, they just all flip over in the different colours. Then it's the fun part, um, then it's popping the stickers on. So as I said, we may, for each of the pages, we put the name uh, of the colour, red, blue, etc. And then Chelsea got the fun part, which was picking all the stickers and putting the stickers onto each of the colour pages. So not only will this book help her in terms of learning about the different colours. Just the process of putting the stickers on was a really good learning experience um, because she got a sticker and she had to find the right page to put it on. So that's it guys, all you need, that's all you need to do in order to create a really cool rainbow paint swatch um, book with all the fun stickers on there that the kids can enjoy. Um, it's actually really sturdy so this has probably been about a week uh, and you'll see because of the contact and the double thickness of each of the paint swatches, uh, it actually stays really um, neat and tidy and it doesn't fray in the edges, which some homemade books I've done before do. Um, so really sturdy and I think we'll enjoy the test of time.